her channel. It's your girl Fatal G. It's your girl Fatal G. And I'm back with another video. <laughs> but yes, guys, I'm so excited. So I'm in DC for the weekend. I kind of just needed a getaway trip to like recoup, relax, chill. Like I've been stressed out with like my masters and like you know school and work as well. So I needed a break. So this is gonna be a mini getaway trip. And it's a solo trip. <laughs> I'm so pumped because I've always wanted to do a solo trip. I've been so scared, but this isn't as bad. And I bet this is more to come because this is giving vibes. But yeah, I literally, I literally came back from the airport, boom, boom, boom. Checked in real quick, thank God, because I came in earlier than I was supposed to. And then I had to head out to catch up with a friend. Like, oh, it was so nice seeing her. Like we haven't seen each other in like 10, nine, 10 years. Like we go way, way, way back from like Nigeria. So it was like really nice, like see her and catch up i'll put a clip up there but yeah i couldn't vlog one because you know we haven't seen each other in years i'm not about to have camera all over her face even if she vlogs as well but still you know i wanted to be in the moment and like enjoy that time with her because we haven't seen each other in years but i am back i was supposed to head out right after that but i just was like i am tired i'm going home so i'm gonna be in the hotel and chill till dinner i'll probably catch you guys when it's dinner time and just catch you all up with why i'm doing this the whole point of this trip but let me show you all the crib because this crib is giving money it's giving oh my god this hotel is so beautiful i'll probably show you guys later what the hotel looks like as well but let me show you what the crib looks like i'm gonna do a little come into the crib with me and the hotel is called yotel i'll put it up on the screen when you come in you know you see this nice mirror right here and they got that over here but like you know i just put my jacket over here my boxes and stuff are over here so voila and then when you walk in a little bit there's another mirror you know me i love my mirror so i can pose period but you got this right here and when you walk here you know dc they're tight i don't know what it is with dc but they be so tight with your spaces you see over here they got the lights you can control that for the tv and i guess the vibe of the room i'll show you guys at night what it looks like and then once you're here here's the bed you can make this a couch and a bed as well i'm sorry i ruined it a little bit and there's a mirror up there as well and that's the tv right here it says welcome to washington dc I know this, right? But yeah, and then this is the mirror. The view. Not really viewing like, you know, my regular trips, but it's a vibe, you know, it's DC. Seeing the city. And there's a mini couch or chair right there. And there's a stand light right there. And boom. Nothing fancy. Like I said, DC is not like so big. And there's a mirror up there as well. And this is the vibe. It's pretty chill for a few days and a one person hey guys so just a quick update i know i look crazy but yeah i'm just kind of like chilling on the bed and like oh my god this feels so nice like <sighs> this feels so nice just chilling relaxing update guys i don't know if y'all have seen my nose piercing but i did get a piercing like is it a month now no i think three weeks ago but yes yo i finally got my piercing i've been wanting one since i was like 18. i'm watching love is blind and so good like i used to see people talk about it i was like never really the girl who was into reality shows except keeping up with the kardashians i think that's the only one i really watched and then recently this year i got into love island which is pretty cool but i really like love is blind and it's crazy because i knew when the show started but i just was never like interested but <laughs> so cool but like i said i have dinner later tonight and i'm low-key this close to canceling dinner and like just chilling in the hotel now it feels so cozy and nice this is so nice i'm so glad i did this just me myself and i with my thoughts and yeah like i'm honestly just doing this because i don't know i just guess i just want to reset you know rethink a couple of stuff you know plan my goals for next year just have some alone time i'd say with myself and my thoughts and my emotions and everything and i honestly cannot deny that this is one of the best things 
things I've ever done for myself. So, like, I highly, highly recommend a solo trip. I'll give you other dates, like, after the trip. But, yeah, let me show you what I'm watching. Guys, I'm at the part where this Asian girl is, like, literally telling her parents <laughs> that she's, she got engaged and she's about to get married in, like, two weeks. Like, whoo! <laughs> Imagine telling your parents two weeks before your wedding that you're about to get married that's crazy and the fact that her parents are asian like i can relate because you know africans and asians kind of like act alike so it's just crazy i know that's right <laughs> it's her face for me her mom's like what the heck is going on Okay, hey y'all, so I'm about to get ready for dinner now. Ah, now I'm lucky excited to go for dinner, but yeah, thank God I didn't cancel. I'm just gonna do something really simple, honestly, because it's not that serious. But yeah, let's just get this face beat a little bit, looking a little bit more glam and more cute. But yeah, I got one hour to get ready and I gotta head out. It's so cold in here. When I tell you guys, it's so freaking cold. It's so cold. Look what I'm wearing, because it's not cold. Not me forgetting to update yo. I'm sorry guys, my lace is lacing right now, but ignore it. Just look at the pretty face. But yeah, I'm on my way now to dinner. I'm all dressed up. I probably put a shot right there so y'all can see what my outfit looks like. I totally forgot to keep vlogging, but I'm about to head up now. I'm like, guys, like almost 45 minutes late. And that's because your girl was busy taking videos. But it's all cool now. I'm about to get ready. Surprisingly, I'm not as nervous as I thought I'd be, but we gonna see. Well, I'm excited to where I'm going. Apparently, it's like a African restaurant, Kenyan. Like, first I was like, mm, it's not Nigerian. I ain't gonna like it, but people have been raving about it, so I'm just like, it, it has to be good for people to say, people who are not Kenyan, to go there. Nigerian, in fact. Because my friend that I met earlier today, she's Nigerian, and she told me she loved it. So, we gonna trust her word. I'm so upset about this lace. Like, I hate when my lace is living. But we did not have time to take care of that, but yeah. I'll see y'all when I get to the cute restaurant. Guys, look at the food. It looks so good. I can't wait to eat it. Bag day one. Ah, complete. Like, the restaurant was so good. Like, I absolutely loved it. It was such a vibe, like, they got me with the Afro beat, the food was great, not only that, like, the, what you gonna call it, like, the customer service, like, they kept asking, are you okay, do you want anything else, like, my server, everybody was just, it was a vibe, loved it, it's called the Swahili Village, if you're ever in D.C., check it out, but damn, the people in D.C., they drive crazy, oh my Jesus, every time I'm in the Uber, my chest be doing bing bing, <laughs> it's like, what's going on, why are y'all driving crazy? Mm -mm. this place is weird like i don't think i could ever drive here Ugh. but yeah i'm just about to go to bed probably take off my makeup chill watch some love island and go to bed not sure if i'll still talk to you guys maybe maybe not if not i'll catch you guys tomorrow but i see you when i see you hey guys so it's another day and i just let me tell y'all one good thing about solo trips is the fact that you're gosh ignore my shirt like you don't have to like follow the itinerary like tell me why i spent a whole month like playing how the strip is supposed to go and today i wake up and i'm just like i don't want to do it like i don't want to go for brunch like i woke up this morning i'm like i'm just gonna uber eat chill in the crib and i'm still deciding if i want to go to the bible museum which is one of the things i have planned for today but i'm not sure we're just gonna go with the flow for today honestly like this is the first time that i plan a trip and i'm like not stressing if things are not going to going according to my plan because i'm such a big planner like if you know me planning and i we're like buddies but sometimes it's just okay to go with the flow so i'm just gonna chill like i slept in today oh my gosh 
this trip has been so amazing like when i tell y'all the past two weeks i've been off and on like falling sick but i think i honestly just needed rest and i've been like stressing a whole lot about a lot of things but it feels so nice to just sleep in and wake up i can't remember the last time i felt this energetic like are you serious but yeah later on today i'm meeting with a friend i'm not really sure if i'm gonna put her on camera because it's kind of weird it's my first time like seeing her in person so i'll see about that i'll try to vlog a little bit but yeah for now i'm just about to eat i got uh what you gonna call it a smoothie i just woke up feeling like you know i want to be healthy which is another weird thing because me when i go on trips like i go all out and i just eat whatever but you know since i'm on the healthy lifestyle i'm just like going on trip don't mean i have to be totally off from like eating healthy so i got me some healthy smoothie and a healthy banana almond toast i believe but yeah i'm gonna show you all Day, guys, I just have this suki set on. Ooh, I love a banging But yeah, I have a jacket. I'll show y'all when I wear the jacket because it's freezing outside. You know, DC is crazily cold. Also, here is the full fit. It's this two-piece set, like I had on the jean jacket, this bag, some boots, and there it is. I was supposed to put some shades on, but oh, my shades are broken. But I'm literally just about to head out now to the Bible Museum. Hopefully, it's really nice. I'm so excited to see it. I just got to the museum right now and it looks so beautiful like it's like so Christmassy look at it I'm gonna show you around so you can see what it looks like I'm so glad I came here it's been so fascinating the technology history of the bible i love it so cute so peaceful you know i love museums like for my thing like art galleries and stuff are my thing yeah i love it out here so nice i'm glad i came hey y'all so i'm currently in the mayflower restaurant i think it's called Person, and it's lit. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the vibe of the restaurant, food, all of that. But I'm not gonna be on camera so much because I'm trying to focus. Talk. Chat. But yeah, I'll see y'all later. I'm so good. Bobby, my family, we start money to show. He made a more girl. <laughs> but yes, y'all, she's about to leave. I'm about to be here by myself. Okay. I wish I could kidnap her for the night. Yeah, she out, yeah. No! What? <laughs> eh? I dare not. I cannot. Yeah, the TikTok dances were fun. Maybe I might insert one of the videos we did, but it was lit. Yes, y'all. I'll probably update you guys when Selena dips. Bye, guys. It was nice meeting you all. <laughs> okay, guys, I gotta walk her downstairs. And I'll see y'all later. Good morning, guys. So I am at the gym right now. Damn, the gym was fancy. <laughs> but yeah, you know, I'm trying to make it a lifestyle theme where it's like even when I travel, I still try to work out, eat healthy as much as I can. So I'm about to get a quick full body workout in. 
and we'll see how that goes. I just wanted to check in with y'all. Yesterday was so nice with Selena. Like, I literally enjoyed Like, she literally stayed with me till like, almost one, I think, where she's doing TikTok dances and stuff. But yeah, let's get this workout in. And I have dinner later this evening. So, I'll see y'all after I get my workout. ready for dinner i know it's early getting ready but still i'm gonna take my videos i just want to take my time today you know them days when you just want to not rush your makeup just listen to some music and just take your time with the makeup i don't want no rushing makeup today so i'm gonna take my time do my hair my makeup and then pack up after but yeah so far the day has been so nice i'm glad i worked out because i feel so energetic right now and whew, guys this is one of the best things i've ever done in my life like I am so blessed. I'm so thankful to God. Like, I'm heavy on God. Thank you. Like, thank you for everything. Whew, I'm getting so emotional. But I'm just so grateful to God. Like, <sighs> thank you, Jesus. Like, guys, I am all ready for dinner now. And I am in a hurry, guys. Like, I'm so late. I gotta hurry up. I just wanna show you guys my feet before I go. And I wish I could. Let me show y'all because I look so, so good. <laughs> Whew, I'm in a hurry, guys. But here's the full fit. And I got some nice, cute silver you know she used to go with it but oh i am giving vibes like can y'all see what i see up here i know this right i look so good period but yeah see you guys at the restaurant chit-chat with y'all like oh i'm still in my outfit but damn i look so good ooh, look at this fine bed <laughs> but yes y'all i that restaurant was fascinating like so beautiful love 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 that love it like i got the best sushi i've ever had in my entire life like what that sushi tastes that good but yes y'all i just kind of want to have a chit-chat real quick about this solo trip I think, I wish I could place y'all somewhere and like just talk. Is it possible? I don't think so, it's fine, I'll just hold it. But yeah, this solo trip has been one for the books, like many more to come obviously, because I honestly, truly enjoyed it. Like this is one of the very few times when I travel and I don't care about my itinerary. Like I'm so big on planning, so big on organization. Like if I'm going on a trip, I'm gonna plan everything to the T, like time block everything. But you know, this trip was just more chill vibes. Like I didn't care about doing. And mind you, it took me a month to like plan my itinerary for the trip. But I got here and I'm just like, girl, no, you need a break. You are on a break from work, from school, and you need to take that break. So I didn't care so much about like, you know going out every time like i literally canceled all my brunches and just like stayed in the hotel chilled watch love is blind and like you know just relax and when i tell you i feel so energized i'm like girl that's all you needed you know to just chill and not like stress over anything and i'm so glad that i did that for the strip and it just kind of sets the tone for like more trips to come where it's like i don't have to be like on the go every time like i usually am some days just take a chill pill some days just rest sometimes just you know just relax like that's what trips are for you don't have to like I don't know, I'll be doing crazy activities every time. But overall, you know, I'm so happy and so thankful to God that I was able to take the trip. Like, obviously, you know, this was money spent, duh. But still, I'm so thankful to God that I'm able to afford this. I highly, highly recommend taking a solo trip. <sighs> it's so beautiful. It's so nice. Like, some people think I'm crazy for doing this because it's like, what are you doing by yourself? But luckily, you know, I got to hang out with two people while I was here. So that was nice. But overall, even the times I got to spend by myself, like I honestly truly enjoyed it. But yes, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and journal a little bit because I definitely wanna write this down. 
yeah i want to write it and look back on it overall this was an amazing trip 10 out of 10 as y'all can tell i'm tired so i'm gonna close the vlog here i believe but if i don't i'll probably i doubt that i'll say anything else but we just might close the vlog thank y'all for coming and my solo trip with me i had the best the best the best the best time i love washington dc can we talk about it like this city is chef kiss i don't think i'll live here because hey the way the drivers be driving it's crazy but you know just to visit i feel like i'll be back here more often than i usually am but yeah thank you all for coming with me once again i'll see y'all when i see you love you bye guys Mr. Mami Oshio, give me the mocha, oh.